Adam Fierstein, the end of the year is nearing, which for you means putting together candidates for the best biotech CEO of 2012. Yeah, that's right, Greg. Um, you know, like you said, every December I, uh, I compile a list of the best biotech CEO candidates, and, and then I let readers vote on a winner. So I'm starting to winnow down a, a long list of potential nominees right now. All right, so who are the front runners right now? Yeah, I'd say Gilead Sciences CEO John Martin uh, is on the list for, you know, for the company's pioneering work on, on new hepatitis C therapy. Uh, Gilead stack is also up an impressive 80% this year. Uh, Onyx Pharmaceuticals got two new cancer drugs approved in 2012. Um, so CEO Tony Coles should be considered. Uh, Regeneron Pharmaceuticals um, has had a phenomenal year uh, of growth. So CEO Landon Schliefer uh, is definitely going to be on the list. What about Arena Pharmaceutical CEO? Ah, uh, <laughs> uh, that, that's a controversial nominee, um, although I'm sure the, the pro Arena crowd would demand it. Uh, you know, Leaf certainly deserves credit for getting his company's obesity drug approved. Uh, but, you know, the drug hasn't launched yet, so it might be a bit early for his nomination. We're, we're going to have to we'll have wait and see on this one. All right, we'll wait for that one. Anyone else on your early list? You know, I have about 20 CEOs on my best CEO 2012 list at, at this point. Uh, that list would include Medivation, Biomarin, Sarepta Therapeutics, Pharmacyclics, Ariad Pharma, and Affimax. Um, you know, I'd love to hear from readers about their, their thoughts. Uh, so please let me know who should be considered. All right. Thanks a lot, Adam.